Hey everybody, Bonnie Donahue here, and I'm here with my daughter Grace. We are posting this live on my Facebook page, Essential Oils for Moms, and I also, you can find me at bonniedonahue.com, and we're gonna be posting the recording to YouTube. So, we are gonna do a take two on this video. We just did it, and we did it the wrong way. It was like sideways, so. Yeah. Um, this is a take two of it. So, today we are showing you a hand sanitizing DIY recipe using your old bottles. Okay, so I see a couple people online. Awesome, thank you. Please tell us if you guys are seeing it the right way. Um, so, I, I never like throw out my essential oil bottles. I always am finding ways to reuse them or gift them or something like that. And so I wanna show you a quick tip of what we do with our old On Guard bottles. Hey Rita, can you let us know if we're sideways or normal? We just did this video and it was the wrong way. So, I'm going to show you a quick tip. So I have an old On Guard bottle. You guys can see there's about 10 drops of essential oils left at the bottom. You know how sometimes the bottom is like really hard to get the last bit of the oils out. So a couple of tricks for you, and I learned this from another advocate, but you take the cap and you twist it on to that little um, plastic part just enough to take the top off without uh, touching it. So you don't have to uh, ruin your nails or get oils on you or anything like that. And then what we're going to do is we're gonna use the 10 drops that, of oil that are in here. If you don't have enough, you can add more to it. Um, this is like a good trick. You wanna get like every last drop out of your bottle, which I like to do that. Um, Another thing, if I'm not using the bottle, I will fill it up with water, like swish it around and like pour it to my diffuser because I never want to waste a drop ever. So this recipe is super simple. You're, we're just going to add aloe vera gel to it. You can also add water. Either one is fine. Um, we're just, we have this at the house, so we're going to use it. We also use the doTERRA hand sanitizing spray, but we can never have too many um, hand sanitizers. We have four kids, we're always out and about. You can throw one in your purse, throw one in your car, throw one wherever, and if you're with friends, you can gift it to them also, because it's just so easy and cheap. Um, oh, and I'll show the top that I made too. Here, let's put this on. It's easy enough for your kids can make this with you, or for you. I just need to see the bottom. So I'm just putting the gel right into the bottle. And then I bought these misting tops at shareoils.com. They're for five and 15 milliliter um, essential oil bottles. Can you put that on for me? Yeah. And that is it, you can see I already made a couple, so we're good to go. This is gonna last us a while. And then, here, I'll spray it on you. It's perfect. There we go. It smells really good. It smells amazing. So simple, it's easy. It feels like it's the fall time, even though it's still summer. I love We're it. smelling this. You can give it to your kids, they can put it in their backpacks for school, so you can wash your hands before lunch, that's a really good idea. Yeah. Um, there's so many things that you can do with these, but the point is, it's easy DIY, no chemicals, you're reusing your bottles. Less than two minutes. Really. Super quick and easy and fun, and that is it. So we will be back later with more tips. I hope you guys have a great day, and if you guys are watching this on YouTube, um, at Bonnie Donahue. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good day. Bye, guys. Bye.